Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today, Wadsburg finally updated. If you can see right in the corner, it says 0.11.1. Now, once I'm editing this video, if the changelog comes out, then I'll post the changelog right up here on the screen. But if not, then I will just basically put the changelog in the comment section whenever they post it. But the time of recording right now, it is 12.13 p.m. and we are basically um, going to check out the update. Everything's going to come as a surprise because I don't know what's out in there except for what I've seen in the decal wave. So we're going to basically check this out. I'm going to pay my bills and my money is going down. So let's head into the build mode. Okay, so in the last video of the Bloxburg updates, we were able to see these brand new stuff with the toilet update, and over here, which is this brand new stuff over here, which was in the um, Halloween update. So now the Halloween items should be gone now, so if we hit this, yep, it just moves it all into our inventory, so the Halloween update is gone. So if you guys didn't stock up on the Halloween items, I'm so sorry, but you guys can't get any more of the Halloween items. So we're gonna go ahead into the new category, and we're gonna, we literally have like no room to put any of the new stuff. So let me just delete this little toilet right here, and we can put some of the stuff right over here, which right off the bat I see some pretty cool stuff. Some pillow. Blood. Okay. Okay guys, this is, we've been needing a lot of this stuff, so let's just start by putting down some of the transitional sectionals. We have a transitional sectional straight, we have a transitional sectional corner, we have a transitional sectional end, and another transitional sectional end, which that's not going to fit right there. Okay, let's end right. Okay, let me just try this for a second. So if I put this transitional sectional right here, then we get our left end. Should work. Yes. Okay, we finally got the sectional. So then Right on here with our sectional, we now have this neatly tucked blanket, which we put it, I think we can put this on couches. I think that this is, you know, what, how can we not put these on couches? So you're going to tell me that we can't put the blankets on the couches? Okay then, what about the pillows? Oh, so if we want to change the pillows, it just basically we can do that, which that's like the comfy pillow, and then we could do that. And that oh my god, that was super cute. No, because wait. Because wait, that looks super cute. Whoa, okay, so we can put some nice new things out on there. And now let me just decorate, let me get like a bed so I can show you guys this brand new thing. So I'm going to grab our cheapest big bed, which is this one right here. Um, I'm gonna, I can show you guys the blankets too, so if we do a new. Uh, I want to do the messy long blanket, which means you can basically do that. And then, what if I want to get new pillows? Okay. Okay. So, let's just do this as the trim rectangular. So, basically, you can basically customize beds even more with this now, which I think is pretty, pretty cool. And then you have, like, your, now your little blanket. Like, they could do, like, that. Um, your drape blanket, which you can kind of do like so, which basically just does this, which I think is pretty cool now that you can customize beds even more with all of this. And then you have like your nice little um, 
pillows that you can put like so, which is pretty cool and neat. Which I kind of like a little bit. So you can put like, you know, some other pillows here as well. That brings those rounded pillows right there. And with all of that, we have these pretty cool, nice little pillows. I want to place down all the pillows. We have this trimmed square one. We have this round one. We have this other round one. We also have the comfy pillow, which is basically your normal pillow. Now let me just put these all out on the open. So we kind of have like all these nice little pillows here now. Um, we have this pillow right here. Um, we have this rounded square pillow right here as well. We have this pillow. We have our folded blanket. Obviously we have our log thing, which put right there, which is another blanket. So that's pretty much a lot of the stuff that we have in this update, but we also get some brand new showers. We have a modern tile shower. We have a modern tile shower again, but this is like the corner shower. So you have your corner shower, and then you have your regular modern tile shower, which I like the shower a little bit. I really like the shower. This could really fit in my house. Um, then next we have the sleek tower, the sleek, sleek tub and shower. And we have the basic shower, tub and shower combo. And we have a new traditional shower set. So let me just build some new walls. Okay. So the new walls we could put right here. Basically what we have now is we have We'll decorate. We have some, we have a traditional shower set. We also have a, a luxury shower set, which gives off light, which that is so luxurious. We have a sleek shower set. Yeah, it looks old. And that's pretty much all the stuff that we have in there for the new stuff. Um, I don't think I put down all the blankets and pillows, but you can kind of see them right over there. Uh, we can see some of the pillows right there as well. But I think that this pretty much sums up a lot of the stuff for this update, which is pretty cool. I kind of like this update a little bit. Um, this update by far is one of the best because we get our, we get our customizable pillows. And also, also the, the brand new chat is right here as well. The brand new chat, which is pretty cool. As you can see this, how, oh my God, it updated the chat too. I just realized the chat, what does the transfer? Transform option? There's a transform option? There is a transform option! Oh my god, that's basically what the transform option does. Wait, let me use the transform option. You can only do it Okay, let me do the transform option on this. Let's put this one is like floating like that. Floating pillows. Wait, because you could do like floating carpets with this stuff as well. Let's see if I search up. Can be moved with transform tool. So we do this right here as transform. These are all the items that we could use to move with the transform tool. Wait, let me put down like a new basic blanket. Oops. Oh, it was just very laggy. So if we use T for transform, you basically can move it up like this, rotate it. Wait a minute. Because this will be pretty cool if you want to put this on couches. So then this basically allows you to put it on a couch. There's no way. There! And then if you want to have like a pillow in like a different place, Basically, Bates brings the move tool and rotate tool 
into two blocks first, which, oh my god, I didn't know about the transform tool, which this looks pretty cool. Which, wow. Okay. That is pretty cool. So they could put, like, you know, some little items right there. So let me just do this real quick. I want to take a screenshot of this picture, and I'm going to post it on Twitter. So if you guys follow my Twitter, you guys can definitely see this creation over here. So basically, that's mm -hmm. all I'm going to do is this picture right here that I just took. Um, you guys can see it on my Twitter, so definitely go check out my Twitter. But pretty much, that's a lot of the stuff that we can finally see um, in build mode. And with all the other changelog stuff, which I don't know if this is going to be in the changelog or not, but there's a new rest option, which I believe you can do it on crunches as well. Um, no, that's just sit. But I'm going to show you guys the new rest. So basically, you're just laying down, and you're kind of like awake, and you're just resting. Um, basically... That brings up your energy as well. So I'm going to try to go back into build mode. And I'm going to place down another couch to see if, like, you know, if we do this right here. Comfort. And that's counters. We're going to do this right here as comfort. And I'm just going to place down the simple sofa. I'm going to see what we can do with this. Okay, so here we go. Here we go. So you have to have a regular couch and not a, like, you know, one of these sectional stuff. So all your custom um, couches, you have to have, like, a regular one and you can hit rest. And basically, basically you go role play as you're sleeping on the couch. Because if you don't want to have, like, a lot of rooms and you want, like, a, your, yourself to sleep on the couch or, like, you're role playing where one of either the mother or father or the child or someone who's just staying over can sleep on the couch. It can literally take sleepovers to a whole nother level with this rest option on a couch. Which I think this is a phenomenal addition to the, you know, update. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. And if you guys did, um, please like and subscribe because I'm not editing this video. This is going to be completely unedited. Except for, you know, adding my intro and outro, so this is going to be completely unedited, it's going to be all of my, um, you know, uh, not talking and talking stuff, but oh my god, this is, looks pretty, 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 pretty cool. Um, um, sure, you can borrow it real quick, um, let's do this here. I'll put that as like a group. Okay, so they're gonna borrow my um, dresser, but I'm gonna go ahead and get the thumbnail for this video, which I think maybe what I could do for the thumbnail is me just sitting, is me just sitting down on here, um, and just doing this right here, which then really work. Okay, well I'm gonna get the thumbnail for the video, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Um, yeah, I'm going to be talking about in the next video where I have been and why I haven't been posting. But happy update day, everyone. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye now.